the American presidency. It has been held by America's smartest, America's boldest, and Africa's worst. But now, of all of the presidents, America is blessed to be living under its greatest. Trump is the greatest president since Ronald Reagan. In the history of our country, nobody has done more than I have. The most presidential person ever. I don't believe there's been any president that has done more. Oh, he's got me down as the greatest president in the history of our country, including George Washington and Abraham Lincoln. Donald J. Trump, the greatest president of all time in history. America's first president was a brilliant general who won our freedom from the hostile ancestors of Meghan Markle. But President Trump is an even superior military mind. In his first week, he declared a travel ban that blocked hordes of Muslim invaders from converting your home into a mosque. For while previous presidents allowed Muslims to infiltrate American society, President Trump knew they were just advance scouts for an army of super Muslims. And although President Ronald Reagan defeated the mighty armies of the Soviet Union, Mr. Gorbachev teared down this wall. He pales in comparison to President Trump, who has defeated the even mightier armies of Mexico. Thanks to his leadership, America is safe from its terrifying picante soldiers. And our southern border is now secure forever because President Trump has built the wall. All coming soon. Teddy Roosevelt was an outdoorsman with a deep respect for nature. But only Donald Trump, a man brave enough to stare down the sun, has made nature respect the president. Under President Trump, America is increasing its water supplies to record levels. Its pristine wilderness is seeing a boom in new energy jobs. And President Trump has ended the brutal windmill genocide against birds. You want to see a bird graveyard? Go under a windmill someday. Rest in power, pigeons. So commanding is the president over nature that Category 5 hurricanes will change their course at the stroke of his pen. Abraham Lincoln brought together a nation divided by war. But President Trump has united us even more by reaching out to the most marginalized Americans, whether they be white culture enthusiasts, overzealous commandos, or unorthodox babysitters. I just wish her well. And although President Lincoln had to confront the Confederacy, a domestic rebellion with many fine people on both sides, Lincoln would have soiled his top hat if he had seen the group of traitors that confronted President Trump. I don't think he's fit for office. A man who is pretty undisciplined, he is unstable, and he really should not have access to the nuclear codes. To use his own words, he's a very, very bad guy. But unlike President Lincoln, Donald Trump survived these vicious attacks. He outflanked the generals. He was too slick for the oil baron. And he put the elf on the shelf. You're fired! Get out! Boom! You're fired! And just as previous presidents pulled us from the ashes of Pearl Harbor and 9-11, so too did Donald Trump guide America through the Russia hoax and an impeachment over a perfect phone call. I made a perfect call, not a good call, perfect call. And it was perfect, better than any phone call Thomas Jefferson made. And abroad, President Trump has united America with global leaders as committed to democracy as himself, Vladimir Putin the Saudis, and Kim Jong-un forging torrid new alliances. We fell in love, okay? No, really. He wrote me beautiful letters. We fell in love. And he embraced the love that brought peace to America, despite the strain it brought to his marriage. In fact, President Trump has made such a good impression overseas that everyone wanted to come to America. 
but not so fast, because we still have The Wall coming soon. In darker times, America spent a decade at the mercy of a nonsensical president. We remain more than a collection of red states and blue states. We are and forever will be the United States of America. Incomprehensible. But President Trump's oratory has brought the English language to new heights and to new words. The combat infantry men made a pivotal remove 10,000 known or suspected gang members. The 9 11, 11 victims. I have to tell you, as bad as it is to measure and other measures, heart, lung, and liver transplants. And an ominous, really an, an ominous. We just sent another sock rocket. These historic accomplishments shades Yosemites, Yosemites. Thailand. God bless the United States. Donald Trump's very, very large a brain. Yes, it truly has been four years of stunning accomplishment, Shays. And by late February 2020, America had achieved a greatness never before seen on Earth. And that seems like a good place to wrap things up. It is time to re-elect President Donald Trump so we can keep dangerous criminals off our streets, finish the wall, and become not just America's greatest president, but the greatest leader of every country in the history of the world. Donald J. Trump, the greatest president in the history of all time. Exclamation point.